this is the update. I set my throttle at 90%. My tail is set at 74%. And I have um, I, I activated the, what do you call it? Inverted flight, the automatic inverted flight. This is the stock battery for testing. Let me redo that. Spread these out. Sorry, y'all. Boom. Put on the canopy. I'm just putting on the canopy because it looks nice. That serves no purpose for this test. I'm on. Um, I'm gonna idle up and I'm going to take off and um what do you call it mode? I'm gonna take off in 3D mode really carefully, really slow. Indoors. I'm I didn't got confident in my flight skills since I got this helicopter. So I got laundry everywhere. Oh well, it's my house, not yours. <laughs> Just pay attention to the helicopter. All right, let me set, let me set this up a little higher. Sorry, y'all. There we go. Let me get y'all some control. All right, you see that light? That amber light in there. So down and out. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Wrong. Let's go ahead and set our third switch down to GPS. We get a green light now. Right? It's a lot clearer now. Then let's go ahead and put our throttles down and out for three seconds and it start flashing. Let's go ahead, run our motor. Now that our, our blades, we're gonna switch our third stick to 3D. It's in 3D mode.
Okay, so I lied. I, we go take off indoors in GPS mode. It got way too close to my foot. <laughs> way too close. <laughs> Extremely too close to my foot. There's a ton of ground effect in here. It's pushing off everything. And as you can see, it's making the ceiling fan even spin. It's a lot of power. I just want to take off a few inches, not much. Let's try it again. Okay, I'm gonna stand up and I'm gonna turn it this way. It seems to be a little better. If I'm right here with the camera and with y'all. All right, we don't have much room, so let's down and out. We are still in 3D mode. That's why it's a blue light now. And let's try to take off. Well, actually, let's go to GPS mode. You can switch to GPS mode while it's pulling up. Okay, you see it's a green light now? You saw it take off and I had to hurry up and recover it. That is because I switched it all the way up to his home position. Don't do that indoors. <laughs> Don't be like me. <laughs> Shoot. All right, let's give this one more go before I get out of hand with this. Let's go ahead and we in GPS mode. You see a green light now. It does down and out. Run and that's slowly bring our throttle up to about 70% in GPS mode indoors. That is enough for tonight. It it's leaning to the right, but we're indoors, so it can be many factors why it leans to to the right. Because we got this big old stand, entertainment stand over here, and just a couch over here, so it can be pushing off that a lot more than the couch. So we'll give it another test tomorrow maybe outdoors but i hope y'all enjoyed this video i hope i learned something and i hope y'all learned something as well so y'all can get out there and get flying because this is a nice piece of equipment a nice toy you can even mount a camera on it it's pretty strong um to get a action camera a little square one or the rectangle one um but this is the fly wing 450 RC helicopter with GPS ability to hover like a drone. Thanks for watching. Um, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos and smash the like button so I can get more videos out there to you. Thank you.